what happened? What took place in 2020 that made it a success? You said three things. Turn it on. Increased penetration, circulation, and market share can hurl away from the handle of your suit. Let's talk about those strengths you guys have, shall we? Local. 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 You're a trusted source in the community. You offer the best coverage and information in local sports. The comments are among the top read sections. The TV Guide. Strong penetration, Quincy Market, and room for growth in Canada. There is, you guys, there is opportunity to increase penetration, circulation, and market share. And my good friend Nathan is talking about that right now. All right, let's jump right in. I always like to start my day with a good quote. Wise man says, we can enhance and improve your daily life. We have Ron Wallace to say that yesterday. searches in with somebody watching a video. That is actually an old statistic. I'm sure Kyle could update us with a new one. 82% of those results come from YouTube. People want to see video. <coughs> Talk strategy for just a second. More video on your newspaper website. So I took a look at both sites. And you do have some videos on there. One thing that all of your reporters have with them is usually a camera, right? Your multimedia and a camera with them. That camera shoots still, but also shoots videos. They also cell phone that shoots videos, everybody has one in their pocket. <laughs> True story, a couple years ago, somebody at our station recorded a truck in a ditch. Just a truck in a ditch, okay? And nobody walking around, it was 45 seconds of a truck in a ditch. Probably the top five most watched videos ever on our website. Video is king. And it doesn't have to be great, it can be shaky, it doesn't have to be perfect because of cell phones now are level of um, integrity in video is dropped, so they don't mind to watch it if it's turned the wrong way or fuzzy or shaky. More video on your sites, we need to do that. We're also going to target your core audience, 35, 50 year old adults. Do not try to make a 25 year old start reading the newspaper. <coughs> it's an evolution, they have to grow to do that. It will happen naturally. We're also going to run a singular message. Yesterday, Brittany sent us eight commercials. That's a lot. I recommend you, you kind of narrow that down High frequency in fewer places. We're going to talk about that a little bit more in a minute. But Ron mentioned out of your $200,000 budget, $140,000 of that goes into broadcast, $60,000 goes into other classes. However, you said GDM products actually help you the best. So I would condense the number of places you're advertising down into a few smaller places that are giving you your best return on investment. Use the people that already love to read your paper to tell your story. Ron, yesterday you were real passionate about your paper, and newspaper <coughs> readers are passionate too. You know, they like to feel the ink on their fingers and turn the page, or you read it online, you scroll, you go there for a more in-depth look at what's going on. <coughs> they have a story to tell. They already love you, and you should take advantage of that. So I recommend a series of 15-second videos with real readers and why they love the wig 
for it, so. It's all creative. I'll give you a brief example. Lady in front of her paper, giggles. I love the wig for the comics. Pat Sally Ford gets me every time. <coughs> you step in, tell us why you love the wig. Upload your video to wig.com or animalnet.com for a chance to win. Okay? I'll give you a couple of examples.
And next year, this time in December, when the snow begins to fly and temperatures drop, and the fireplaces burn, and you reach out to grab a glass, reflecting back, celebrating the success of 2020. Remember, will this presentation be done by then? <laughs> <laughs>